Hey, what's up everyone? It's Bobby. Today I'm going to be giving you guys my unboxing and my review of the Snug Buds Pumped uh, headphones. Now, Snug Buds sent these to me for review and I'm just going to open it up and show you guys what's in the package. Alright. Wow, there's like a lot of stuff in here. Alright, cool. So it looks like we have two, uh, so we have the Snugged Pumped and the Snug Buds uh, Pumped for the iPhone. Now I believe these ones have a braided cable without a mic and these ones uh, don't have a braided cable but they do have an inline mic and um, the iPhone headset jack so I'll just get into both of these. Alright so I'm going to get into the Pumped for the iPhone. How do I open this? Alright, well you guys get the idea um, with the unboxing, I mean it's pretty straightforward packaging. I will just get back to you guys when I have used these for a couple days and I'll give you guys my review. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Bobby. Today I'm going to be giving you guys my review of the Snug Buds Pumped Edition. Now, uh, earlier before you guys saw me review the Snug Buds SBX Chrome or something like that, um, Snug Buds was nice enough to send me out a new uh, set of headphones. These ones are the Pumped Edition. Now, um, they come in multiple different flavors, so I'm just going to run through you guys and tell you guys the prices for those. So you can get the Pumped Baron, and you guys are seeing the pictures. So the Pumped Baron, those are $38.95, and they have a braided design, and they're black and red. They look pretty cool. Then you can also get the Pumped for the Black, or the Pumped, and they're in black and they are for the iPhone slash Droid slash Blackberry these will run you forty dollars so just basically an extra dollar and um, they that's what I have right here and they also have the inline microphone but they're not a braided design now I'll explain what that is in a minute then you can also get the pumped ice the pumped shorty or the pumped Iron Man now these are the Iron Man really cool looking the ice and the shorty also look really neat um, but uh... I'm going to be reviewing these two, but I'm sure they're basically the same. And those will all run you $38.95. So, five different options, five great different headphones, and I'm going to be reviewing these two. They're basically the same headphones, except for one is meant for the iPhone. One is meant for just universal, all different MP3 players. They come in these cool little tubes when you buy them. All the crap in there, that's all just extra ear bits that I have. I just decided to keep them all in here. They also all come with an inline clip. Now, if you guys watched my uh, other Snug Buds review, you guys know that I said that the clip broke off. The clip did not break off on these headphones, but I'm just not a fan of clips, so I took it off myself. But the clip is definitely good quality. Um, I guess the one I had before that broke the second I took it out, that was just a bad one in the bunch, I guess. But these headphones clips are worked perfectly. I just took them off because I don't really like clips on my phone. So these are the iPhone edition. Um, they also work with the BlackBerry, the Droid. Very long cable, very nice cable. Um, didn't have an issue with cable length. Oh, didn't have an issue with cable length. Um, I'm going to untangle them. Now as you guys see right here, it has a built-in inline mic. Unfortunately this mic doesn't have the volume up, volume down. Um, I don't know if it can do the triple click to go back, double to go forward. I know it does do double to go forward and one click to pause. It does have the microphone. I have tested it on a call and it worked well. The audio quality on the Snug Buds Pumped Edition, both of them, is great. It is amazing audio quality. Not the strongest bass because I did used to have the Radius Atomic Bass headphones. But uh, these headphones definitely have plenty of, uh, it just has all around really good audio quality. So if you're looking for headphones that will just provide you with really good audio quality and you're not too concerned about pumping bass or um, any of that stuff, anything in particular, you just want good all around headphones, the audio quality on the Pumped Edition headphones is great, especially uh, because they're only $40. Now uh, the design, very neat on this one, it's just kind of like a black plastic uh, not, not, I mean, it's a good build quality. I don't feel like it's going to break. Um, they clink when you tap them together, so maybe it's some sort of, like, metal. I'm not really sure exactly what it's made of, but good audio, uh, good build quality. Now, the one thing I don't like about just this one edition, oh, by the way, it also has a 3.5 millimeter headset jack, and it's a straight shot, which I like these a lot better 
than, um, for example, with the SBX Chrome and the uh, other one. It's a bent. It's a bent design. But this one is a straight shot, so you can just plug it straight into your iPod or your iPhone. I think that looks much better than having a bent cable, but it just goes down to personal preference. They both fit inside the iPhone. Um, the one thing I don't like about the iPhone edition, and this is just uh, specific to the iPhone edition, is the build quality of the cable itself. It feels really, really thin. I, I mean, I bet you anything that if I were to just pull it, it would break for sure. Um, very, very kind of, I feel like it's kind of malleable, 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 I'm not sure if that's a word, but I think most of you guys get what I'm saying. You can pinch it and it'll stay creased. Um, not a very thick cable, so I am very careful whenever I'm using these headphones. Whenever I'm wrapping them up, I'm making sure not to pull it tightly because I don't want anything internally to rip. That's what happened to uh, a pair of um, Skull Candy headphones I had before and caused them to break in one ear, at least. One ear wasn't working. Um, the build quality of this cable, not the greatest, but it I haven't had any problems with it just because I've been careful. And I'm sure you guys won't have any problems with it as long as you're careful with it. So just keep that in mind. If you plan on buying the iPhone edition because you really want that inline mic, just be careful with them. I mean, it's not like you have to, like, protect it with your life. They will, like, withstand a lot. But I'm just saying it's definitely possible to break these. I haven't done it, but I definitely think it would be possible to. So just be careful if you're planning on getting the iPhone edition. Now let's go over to the Iron Man edition. Okay, so now I'm going to be reviewing the Iron Man Edition. Same audio quality, same uh, really clear, crisp audio that you're going to get with the iPhone Edition and any of the other pumped edition headphones. The build quality of these is definitely a metal, very solid of uh, the actual earbuds themselves. I definitely feel like these wouldn't break. Um, I haven't run into any issues with them so far, and it they look really cool. The gold and red does look very similar to Iron Man and they do turn a lot of heads when you have those red earbuds sticking out looks really nice now as for the cable on this one very long cable but also this has a braided design and if you guys watched my other uh, review of my other one you know I really do like braided designs now if you take a look at these two I don't know you really can't see that one looks like a shoelace and one looks like a normal cable this is the one I like more that shoelace kind of feeling is it really really durable I know I just don't think I could break these I mean maybe if I pulled as hard as I possibly could I could break these but as for um, everyday usage there's no way you're gonna break these and also that braided design also really helps with tangle free now I know I think they advertise it to be completely tangle free definitely not the case I've definitely been able to knot this up and tangle it just by crumpling it up and putting it in my pocket but because it does have that braided design and it just kinda slides off each other and it just wants to be straight um, really easy to untangle that's the main killer for me now like I said earlier I'm not really a fan of the bent headset but then again it just comes into personal preference it will work with the iPhone 4 um, if you have some cases on it like for example this crap case throwaway case I got in the mall this jack is really small and it is kind of a stretch getting this to fit you have to push it in really deeply and kinda wiggle it in a little bit to make sure that um, this little sit around thing actually goes into the um, phone itself but not very much of a problem very good uh, very good headphones I mean I've been really impressed with snug buds I really appreciate them sending me their new headphones for me to review um, very very good audio quality not a problem as for staying in your ear on runs that was the last thing I was gonna touch on um, I've ran with both of these headphones and both of them they do stay in your ear, but my ears are really oddly shaped or something like that. I don't know what it is, but I've just never been able to find a pair of headphones that 100% stay inside my ear and will not come out. These ones, they were pretty close, but I was able to make them come out when I was doing hill sprints and stuff like that. So hopefully in the future, um, I'll be able to find the perfect headphone that stays in my ear. But these are really close seconds. So, I mean... If you know that, uh, if you know what size earbuds you use, if you're small, medium, or large, and one of those fits your ears perfectly, these will definitely sit in your ear really well. Um, I'm still trying to find a perfect like hybrid size for my ears, but most people uh, will be able to choose a small, medium, or large and have it work perfectly. And these definitely 
uh, do the job well. So thank you Snug Buds for sending these out to me once again. Two really great pairs of headphones. Um, can't wait to review whatever you guys have in the future. If you ever wanted to, uh, if you ever want me to do another review, just send me an email. But yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. Two great headphones. The link to the page of Snug Buds is right below, along with my Twitter and my Facebook fan page. So make sure you guys go like my Facebook fan page. And I will see every single one of you guys next time. So, peace. Fail, I just hit the camera.